This is day two on my road to a 90% acceptance rate in Uber for Uber X driving. My name is John from Ride Upstate. Thanks for joining me along on this journey. When I started today's trips, I was at a 50% acceptance rate and a 12% cancellation rate. So let's take a look. I did four trips on day two. So the first trip I did today was for $10.65 for 3.9 miles. $5.65 was for the fare and I received a $5 tip. The next trip was for $36.81. The upfront fare was $27.22 and I received a tip of $9.59 and that was for a 27.8 mile trip. The next one was for $9.31 for 6.9 miles. No tip on that one. And then finally $8.37 for 4.6 miles and that came with a $2 tip. So $6.37 was the fare and a $2 tip. And those were the only four trips that I took on that day. Uh, it was a tough miles to dollars day because of the trip that I took to the airport. But again, the point of this experiment is number one, to get to 70%, and then eventually, hopefully, to get to a 90% acceptance rate. So while I made roughly $25 per hour, the per mileage rate was closer to like 80 cents per mile. I haven't done the exact calculations yet. In the future, I hope to do shorter rides and um, just take one ride after the other to get that acceptance rate up to 70 and then to 90%. Very tough in this market. We'll see what we can do. So because I only did four trips this day, my acceptance rate and cancellation rate did not change at all. It's still at 50% for acceptance rate, and it's still at 12% for the cancellation rate. This is going to be a long haul, folks. And I think I mentioned in the previous video, I'm probably not going to update this um, regularly. When I hit some significant milestones, I'll probably mention those, and maybe I'll do a weekly update because this is going to take months to get through this. So most likely going forward after today, it's going to be weekly updates. Um, as I mentioned last time, those first 15 trips that I did on one day, that's more than I normally do in a week. So long haul here, folks. I appreciate you sticking with me. Uh, and as always, I just want to remind you that just because you're in a small market doesn't mean you need to settle for small profits. Bye.